I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question on quadratic function. In this particular question, we need to find the y-intercept for a quadratic function with x is of symmetry at x equals to minus 1, x-intercept of 3, and maximum value of 32. So I just written down what is given to us. It is x is of symmetry x equals to minus 1 x intercept 3 that means the coordinate point is 3 0 y value 0 maximum of 32 so that's the maximum value now since we are given the maximum it really means that the parabola will be opening downwards right so so parabola will be kind of like this right and uh, what we can do here is we can sketch now uh, that's seems to be the point of the vertex. What should be the vertex in this particular case? Since axis is at minus 1, this point vertex will be minus 132, correct? So only at on the axis will have the vertex. That's how it is, right? Now, we are given x of symmetry, x intercept of 3 and maximum. So that is kind of the parabola. And we also know that the x intercept is uh, let me just sketch this line here so this is minus one so y axis will be let us say somewhere here okay that's y axis since x is, is at minus one this is x equals to minus one and that point here is the x intercept at three question is find the y intercept for a quadratic function we need to find this point right Let's call this point as B, the y-intercept. I hope you have understood the question. You can pause the video, answer, and then look into my suggestions. Now, since we know the vertex, we can write the quadratic function in vertex form, which is y equals to a times x minus p whole square plus q, where p, q are the coordinates of the vertex. So in our case, the coordinates for the vertex are minus 1 and 32, right? So, so minus 1 for P will make this plus 1 here. Minus minus becomes plus and plus 32. So that is the equation which we get. Now we need to find the value of A. To find the value of A, we can use the x-intercept, which is 3, 0. So I'll substitute 0 for y and 3 for x to find the value of a, right? So let's solve it. Taking 32 to the left side gives us minus 32, a times 4 square, which is 16, right? So we could write this as 16a equals to minus 32, and a equals to minus 32 divided by 16. So that gives us value of a as minus 2, correct? So we have got the equation of this parabola. Let me rewrite this equation with a as minus 2. So the equation will be y equals to minus 2 x plus 1 whole square plus 32. Is it okay? So that becomes the equation. Now the question here is find the y-intercept. So we have to find the y-intercept, correct? So how do you find y-intercept? y-intercept is a point here where x is 0, right? So at this point, x is equals to 0. So we'll substitute 0 for x and calculate the y-intercept. So y will be equals to minus 2 times 0 plus 1 whole square plus 32. And that is minus 2. This is 1, right? You can write plus 1 plus 32 or minus 2 plus 32. And that gives you a value of 30. And therefore, our answer is y-intercept. is 30 right as far as the coordinate points are concerned you could also write this as 0 30 is it okay so that is how you can actually solve such a question i hope you understand the concept from what is given you could get a image or figure in your mind as we have shown here and then find the equation since the vertex is known to us vertex form is good point to start from solve for a get the equation and then find the y intercept i hope the steps help you to understand thank you and 
All the best.